Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 15, take two of our Climbing the Ladder FM20 Journeyman save. You ever have one of those days? This was one of those days. So, we were supposed to come back for Hassle Homes and Bromo Pajamas, and uh, I recorded them, and we won both games, and the video saved, and my power went out hadn't saved in the game though so power's out for i don't know about 40 minutes power comes back on i lost get the computers back up thank god no no power surges or anything uh good thanks for that yep not saved so i've got to replay the matches so i wasn't looking for the same score i was just looking for the same result we had to play hassle homes three times lost the first two Finally beat them 2 0. We beat them 2 to 1 in the initial one. And then Bravo Pajamas, we beat them 4 0 in the first replay. We actually beat them 3 to 1 the first time around. So, top of the table, we dominated them 7 to 1 on aggregate, 4 to 4 to 1 aggregate against Hassel Holmes. So, we're going to call our, you know, it was still two wins. Uh, we did give up goals uh, the first time around, but we're going to. Take credit for the clean sheets. After we beat them, we were coming up on the transfer deadline. And I said, you know what? We just beat these guys. We're second in the table. Automatic promotion. Hmm. We've got a lot of transfer budget, a lot of payroll budget, a little bit of payroll budget. Even though we're losing money, you know what? I'm going all in. We're going to go after promotion this year. Now, if we fall short, we're going to be kind of screwed. So let's take a quick look at transfers. Philip Lindbaum, our leading striker. Somebody made an offer. Uh, I don't know. Nats. Nats. I'm going with Nats. Uh, they made an offer of $2,600. His value is $2,900. He's not in the last year of his deal, is he? Uh, no, he's got he's got over a year left. Yeah, we're not in our we're not in a hurry to, but he uh, as long as he's willing to sign with us, unless somebody offers a lot. A couple of episodes back, we put a we put his va uh, requested uh, bid at three hundred and seventy five thousand. It's gonna take a big bid to pry him away from me, unless he's just not gonna sign a contract. I brought this guy in on trial. He's another striker. He would be our number two striker. I offered to pay him $3,600 a month. He's thinking about it. He's a free agent. He's pretty good. He's pretty good. Solid first touch, decent finishing, heading. He can't jump, but he can head the ball. I guess he does diving hitters. Don't know. But anyway, hopefully he comes in. Uh, let's see. Jacob Svensson, because he can play mid center and striker, I turned I rejected the offer on him. I actually asked him for just a little bit of money. They wanted him on a free. Uh, he's valued at eight hundred. I think I asked for six hundred and twenty percent of his future sale, and they canceled. They canceled the bid. Now, where are we weakest at? Yeah, that's right. We're weak at center back. Well, Tom Croon. I wanted to cut some money, so we moved him to Magny on a free. Uh, he'd started a good number of games for us, but mostly was a bench and reserve player. Uh, so he goes out, and with that money, we freed up. Uh, Philippe Bowman, you, you didn't see him. He's another new striker. I really had to think about offering that. In fact, I don't know, man. We've got this guy. He can play center mid, though. I may play him as a center mid as a better finisher. That that may be an idea. Hadn't thought about that. Thank you for bringing that up. That was a good call on your part. Uh, but here's where it gets interesting. Joachim Nyborg uh, is now a Carl Skrona player. Left and right back, solid physicals, good defender, not so great going forward, but he can pass the ball decently. And he's got really good mentals. So we brought him on to anchor down the left and the right side. He may start probably going to be a reserve, but he's from the Super Rattan, uh, which 
Isn't that the league we're in? Yes, it is. Ah, it's the league we're in. Never mind. I was about to sound real stupid and say he was from the level above. Uh, Linus Gustafson. He's a right back, but no, he will play center back for us. Six foot three. He's not the paciest guy, but he's fast enough. He's got really good defensive skills, and oh my God, he has a seven heading. Remember, our starting center backs have a max heading of five. So better defense right there with Gustafson. And then Ludwig Johansson. He's got a nine, by God. He's six foot six. Holy cow. So I think that's going to be our new starting center back duo. That's the goal. And I think... I don't know why I thought I had one more player offered. Oh, well. Anyway, so we're back today. We are going to be playing uh, Teamra and Sirius. Let's get to it. Uh, I actually had re-recorded this. I shaved two minutes off the intro, so that is excellent. Uh, we are going to – let's pick uh, Let's pick the entire team. All right, let's not do that. Gustafson slots in here. He's made four appearances, so he's not new. Lindbaum. I want to play. I want to play. Bowman's pretty far down. Eh. All right, but he is on the bench. All right, but no, I want. I definitely want to play these two guys. Oh, and this is another guy we're looking at, Larson. Um, he's thirty-three. I don't. Oh, you know what? He would not talk to us. Let's go back. Oh, well, I'll look at him later. All right, who are those two guys that we just brought in? They may not be at the club yet. <laughs> Sorry, they're putting groceries up and stuff in the kitchen. All right, Linus Gustafson and Gustafson and Johansson. All right, there's Johansson. Where... Oh, you know what? God dang it. Does Gustafson not come in till the end of the season? Come on. Did I screw up and put him? Says he's at the club. He's coming from Sweden. Oh, he's on the reserves. Ah, well, let's fix that shit. Come on. Come on. Damn it. All right. Development center. Damn. Reserves. Squad. There he is. He's only one and a half star here. That's that's troubling. That's okay. I want him on the... There we go. Move to senior squad. Thank you. I was like, where the hell did he go? All right. And Hallen. I want Gustafson in there. And then... Hallquist. Nyborg. Erickson for sure. All right, let's go with that. We'll figure this out as we go. I do have a couple of extra guys. Actually, damn, Hallen's. I think I want to play Hallen on the outside. Or maybe not. And then Yo uh, Johansson. Let's put him in for Nyborg for right now. All right, let's do that. Yeah, you guys have some issues. I really hope, I really hope these guys can shore up our center line. Oh, I'm nervous now. All right. We're both playing 4 4 twos. We're in the orange. Squared into Ingberg. Oh, look at the slide tackle. Excellent defensive play. All right. Look at our big lad there, six foot six. He's a big kid. All right, Alonzo blows it over the top. Spinson. Oh, nice through ball to Lindbaum. Can't turn it around the keeper. Cleared out. We'll take the throw in. All right. All right, Hallen. Nice ball into Lindbaum. Spenson. Oh, nothing there? No? All right, 
Thony comes back out and grabs it. Offsides. Offsides. Come on, Lynn Baum. You're better than that. Better than that. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, why? Why Seriously? Why even show that? Oh, my God. The fans are going crazy. All right. That one's over there. Oh, look at Johansson come in there with the header. Oh, he gets beat. Oh, Hagland. Good save by Gustafson in the goal. What the hell is that? Oh, disallowed goal. Who the hell? Was Johansson missed the header. Okay, that was kind of ugly. Vaj, nice. Lindbaum, good job. Tackled away. All right. Let's get creative. Oh, inspired. The words of their leader. All right, a couple of quick shots. We had only had one shot up to that point. Damn. Okay. Hagland, another nice save by Gustafson. All right, ooh, he headed it out. That was our one of our new center backs heading it out over the touchline, giving him another corner. All right, and Gustafson, the keeper, looks like he gave it right back to him, didn't it? Hmm. All right, come on, boys. Nobody made a run out. Come on. Solid looking defense so far. Over the top. Oh, the flick on header. That was nice. Eric Haglin, his 11th of the season. Hmm. All right. Let's uh, show some passion for the final minutes of the first half. All right. Deep throw into the box. Oh, the header. Just goes high. We had a shot there. All right, so, hmm. If we go look at the tactics, let's drop our tempo a little bit. Gustafson, I am going to bring on Erickson. Actually, you know what? Let's undo that. I'm going to swap him with Alonzo, and I'm going to try Bowman in there. I'm going to try Bowman. So Bowman is typically a striker, but he's got good finishing. He's got seven passing. Bash has 14, so I want Bash to be my playmaker. Bowman can be the, the and we're going to move him up to, uh, we're going to put him as a central mid on attack. Alonzo, I'm going to drop him back to support. Yeah, yep. Let's do that. That's a change. Disappointing. Uh, watch your second yellow. All right, we've been outshot 12 to 6, which is unusual. I don't know what it is they're doing. Well, they've gone to a 4-3-3. You know, the last time I think we played a 4-3-3, we, we kind of got dominated. Oh, Alonzo moving out to that right wing, pounces. Uh, that was an ugly shot. Might. I might want to tell him to. No, he's already being told to shoot less often. Okay, well. Shoot less often. <laughs> How about listen? Shouldn't have shot that ball. All right, demand more. It's up. Oh, what a save by the keeper. And I'm guessing there was an offside. Yep, Alonzo. All right, 
Johansson. Let's bring Hallquist in. We need to get him match fit. Thony for Erickson. Yep, we'll do that. Bergman. Oh, no. No! Inberg with his 10th of the season. Just past our keeper. Oh, I don't know. Might have been some interference right there, guys. I think so. All right. Up to Alonzo. Squared into Bowman. All right, there's one of our there's one of our new players. Over the top, Spinson flicked away by Anderson. Ah. We really need a goal here. Get creative. Falk. Oh man, I thought that was going in. They're getting a lot more shots. I don't know what the deal is there. All right, he lumps it. Falk. That was, I think, that new, you know, that that fixed run. Lindbaum on the breakaway. Ah, damn. Oh, he puts it out into the stands. That's a time waster. Oh, he's wide open. Oh, my God. Didn't we see that last? Oh, by the way, the patch came out today, so we are seeing the new match engine. And actually, the goal that we gave up was just like that. The keeper got his hands on it, and it went right through him. So I don't know if that's if they're going more jelly hands with the keepers or... Uh, want to run get that ball there buddy um or whatever but oh oh taken down in the box that's oh dirty dirty yeah but we're down three Ugh. oh nice nice shot Lindbaum with his 17th definitely not selling him for a below value bid all right. Um, yeah, we've all, we've made all three subs. I don't think push forward. Crossed in. Nope. Badge. Damn. Oh, good. Oh no. All right. Good save. Oh, he put it out. That was lucky. I think before the match engine fix. Look at that. Our second striker's playing a six. That's brutal. All right. Well, 3-1 loss. I tell you what. We're going to end the episode there just because the, uh, you know, everything that we did before, letting you guys know about the replays and uh, some of the transfer news took up a little bit of time. I don't want to go over the 30 minutes. So we'll end this one a little bit early. Uh, it was disappointing. We've got one more guy I think we're looking at. I'm going to go check all the guys that we've got on trial. Uh, just out of curiosity, I wanted to look one more time. Uh, let's see. Gustafson played a 6-8. And he had two key passes from center back. That's nice. And Johansson played a 6-6. Six, six. That's not horrible. Hallquist played a 6-9. So I'll have to think about that. How did uh and Bowman, yeah, Bowman played a 6-4? Again, he hadn't had a lot of game action, so we'll see. Uh liking Baj in there. I think Baj and Alonzo make a good pairing in that center. So I don't want to mess with that. So, oh, well, I do, you know, but I do have a little more depth at center back. So that'll be good. All right, guys, well, hit the like button for me. Subscribe if you don't mind. And as we said last time, I think we come back for Rosengard and Helsenbergs now, because uh, I think that's what I was planning on originally after that. 
will be through the cup and then we'll have, so we'll have that and then the season finale unless we have some more cup cup action going on but anyway we'll see you next episode and i apologize for the power outage not that there was anything i could do but i'll apologize anyway it's just kind of guy i am we'll see you later bye